What's up, guys? Um, it's uh, I'm back here in Austin after spring break, and uh, I gotta say, and first off, I gotta say congratulations uh, to the Kansas Jayhawks for beating us yesterday um, in in the Big Twelve Championship. I mean, uh, you know, there's no sour grapes here with me, man. You know, it was a great ball game. Uh, the first the first half uh, looked like a game of horse. Both teams scoring everything. Uh, second half slow the pace slowed, and you know we hit the four minute mark, and we could hit anything. They got hot, you know. Chalmers was the killer, and Brandon Rush had probably the best game of his career, and uh, you know we couldn't pull it out. So you know, three years in a row we've lost to Kansas in the Big 12 Championship. But this video is not mostly just about that game, but just the tournament overall. And I just got to say, congratulations to the Big 12. We showed everyone that this is not just a football conference. We can play some basketball too. Um, you know, a team that really impressed me was Texas A&M. Texas A&M. Uh, you know, they won, they beat Iowa State, as they should have. Then they beat Kansas State with Michael Beads and whatnot. And I, I'm really, the thing is, I'm looking at Kansas State. Kansas State seems to be the downslide for me. They've still got Beasley, but I think they keep, they, they're relying on him way too much now. Um, but, you know, in A&M, and then A&M gave Kansas a run for their money. I mean, was physical with them, only lost by six, uh, come down. So, I mean, it, so A&M, I think, really, really impressed me. Um, Oklahoma. You know, Oklahoma, I felt they were one of the weakest four seeds we've had. Um, I'm really not sure how they even got that. I know it was, you know, records and stuff. I mean, I, the thing with Oklahoma, they live off of Blake Griffin. They can't shoot. They, they can't. It's all about Blake Griffin, who, who is a beast. Blake Griffin, you know, we make fun of him around here, but the guy can play, and he's tough. He's a tough dude, and, you know, they live off of him getting offensive rebounds and playing inside because they really can't hit shots consistently from the outside, and that's why we were able to pull away when we played them. Um, Colorado made a good showing, you know, beating Baylor, which doesn't say much for Baylor. You know, Baylor Baylor made it into the March Madness tournament, um, and, you know, I, I'm glad to see that. You know, we got six Big 12 teams in, in the tournament this year. But, see, the thing is with Baylor, I don't see them winning the game in, in March Madness because – um, they're they're not reliable at this time of the year. I, I don't know how many games they've like played. Baylor fans, let me know. I think y'all won like three of the last eight or something like that. And then you lose to Colorado in the first round. So you know y y they've got a good team on them, but I don't I don't see they have like no momentum right now. I, they they may just be happy right now just to be in. So I don't know what to say about them. But overall, the tournament was just excellent. Every single game for the most part was close, came down to the wire, and was highly competitive. And I just want to say congrats to everyone in the Big 12 who participated. Um, it was an excellent, you know, the Texas Tech, um, the Texas Tech Oklahoma State game was uh, a good one, you know, and it came down to the wire. You know, a turnover at the end caused the, the difference. And once again, Oklahoma State uh, played us really tough. You know, they played tough three times this year. We've come up on top both times, but they've, you know, played tough uh, each time. So, once again, uh, congrats to the, all the Big 12. We made a good showing here. Congratulations, Kansas, for winning again. Uh, you know, I, the thing is, I, I've already filled my bracket out. I've got, I've got, I'm, let me give you guys a preview of the next upcoming videos. I'm kind of busy this week, but it's still March Madness, so I've got to get out here and talk about it. I've, got, I've filled out two brackets here. One is what I really think is going to happen, and I'll talk about that in the video. Also got one, and I can't say I came up with this idea. I got this from uh, ESPN where they did some little joke video. I did one based purely on mascots and which mascots would win a fight. And so, and it'll be kind of funny at the end to see if that one actually does better than the real ones because I'm usually terrible at this bracket stuff. So, uh, that'll be fun to do. Uh, check that out. So, guys, check those videos out when they come out this coming week. Can't wait for basketball coming up this weekend. But, once again, congratulations, Kansas. And uh, always, hook them horn. We got the two seed. We're in the south and uh, pretty much got home games throughout, hopefully. So, hook them horn, guys. See you.